Hi Leo, welcome into a brief next 48 hour tarot reading for you. I do want to thank you so much for your amazing presence as always, but I do want to remind you that this is general and it's meant to pertain to the following 48 hour period for you beginning around when you're guided or drawn to this video, not just following when I post it, but we're going to use the sacred traveler oracle deck and um, get this reading going for us. All right, for Leo. I just heard one productive master, one productive master. Watching clouds, mystic healer, and gates of triumph. There's a door that you're walking through, about to walk through. You could be acquiring a new opportunity, like a new job in the next 48. It's up to you whether or not you feel it's meant for you, but you manifested it either way, okay? Um, I do feel like as well, you're attracting opportunities for love if you're single, um, and potentially even if you're in a relationship, okay? Be careful what you wish for. This has come through in your readings before because you're quite easily um, attracting in who and what you desire. And even just more so what you're meant for at times, okay? But naturally with this here, um, look at that, take action with passion. I'm not surprised. I feel like you're gonna get a ton accomplished and it's gonna feel so damn rewarding, but you will feel burnt out at certain points, period. But I, I sense that you'll with certain levels of ease and, um, and uh, strategy, you'll find out how to, or you'll figure out as you move through the next 48, how to get done what you need to when you need to, and you won't feel ultra stressed, um, at least most of the time in regards to all of which. But success is expanding in your life, Leo. How good does that feel to uh, see, to hear, to experience, right? Um, it feels like your hard work is paying off in more than one way, on more than one level, okay? But there's a focus on you being a healer, okay? It could be more so in regards to somebody else being a healer. But in one way, shape, or form, I feel like you do heal others. It could be more so with the words you speak, being a listening ear, I just heard a shoulder to cry on for some, but I feel like as well for a lot through your work, through your energy, it just feels like you're able to say the right thing at the right time, or you're just, even your presence heals a situation, okay? Um, but Spirit's also saying for the spiritually connected um, healing uh, Leos out there, you're going to find that your skill sets in that category of life start to expand and uh, transform moving forward. And that can feel very eye-opening, okay, in regards to your life, your life purpose. Um, but watching clouds as well, talking about lying back, rest, and relax, okay? As much as you need to accomplish a lot in the next 48, you need to find time to relax, okay? Um, I do feel as if you're going to, some of you might have more relaxation outweighing the productivity in the next 48. However it works for you, I do feel like the majority drawn to the reading do have a lot to get done and then you find time to take care of oneself, to relax. And I feel like even potentially previous to this 48 hour period for you individually, your sleep is improving. Why is that? You made the right choice or you're making the right choice, okay? Or decisions, adjustments, however ends up working for you. It just feels like through realizations, remembrance taking place and just new informing coming to be. Interesting, new downloads and intuitive hits coming to be. Um, you need to be completely honest with oneself and you may even be pushing levels of honesty towards other people or out of other people um, in regards to how things are falling into place. Interesting. In your situation and theirs. I hope that made sense. For Leo. Take a deep breath. You're doing well. Um, I also feel like there are certain moments where you're not meaning to fully or maybe you are, but coming off like a, bit, a bit judgmental, excuse me. Um, and don't be surprised if spirit makes you slip up in those moments to kind of put you in your place a little bit. Um, the Fool card coming out because we're focusing on a leap of faith for oneself. But are you having fun in the midst of all your accomplishing? Are you having fun in those simplistic resting periods of the next 48 for you as well? I sense that being drawn to this reading, you do like the comfort of others, right? You do like to have those quality connections and socializing here and there but you are very, very good at this point along your path. They're saying very strategic and skilled in being alone. And that's a beautiful thing. It takes a really strong, uh, secure person to enjoy and make the best out of their alone time. I know I have become so okay with it over time, but it's not to say I don't like to connect with other people when the time is right and when um, I'm feeling in the mood. Does that make sense? It's coming up for a reason. I just heard one person will be so happy to see you, but they're a little concerned or just 
wondering what's going on. Um, potentially you're not being a, a very, uh, as much of an open book as you once were or in general. Um, but being the emperor of your situation and just doing what you have to do, right? Accomplishing more than meets the eye or just, I feel like somebody at a distance as well is seeing you as someone who's doing better than they expected. Good for you. Good for you. It sounds like, I sense that you're an individual, bear with me, who laughs it off when they struggle, right? At times you're overly serious because of all you have going on, but then when things feel brighter and lighter and you heal and you get a good night's rest, it's like you, you bounce back, right? And so um, in those moments or just throughout the next 48 in general, you'll see evidence that your world is changing. But I also feel like you're the type of person that without meaning to or just without forcing it, rubbing it in people's face even, you prove people wrong when they, even if they don't express it, they doubt that you were going to be successful with a new beginning or just the situation in general or the continuation of something, right? It's the Leos that are drawn to the specific 48 hour reading that prove people wrong with the uh, evidence, the rewards, the uh, success along the way, okay? Um, they're saying let your um, thriving, let your glow, let your the evidence of your hard work um, and the rewards all the meanwhile uh, speak for themselves or speak for itself. Yeah, the Wheel of Fortune naturally. And so I do feel like you're seeing the wheel turn for you in a beautiful way. And it's gratifying to say the very least, right? It's a long time coming or you're just seeing oneself, um, okay, noticing the wheel turning for you in the moments when you're pushed to slow it down or you just feel like you don't have a choice whether or not to slow it down or not right? Your body just um, yells at you or you just lose your breath, right? For one reason, if not multiple. Um, but so they're saying even the downtime isn't wasted, obviously. And I feel you know that. But in another sense, you're, um, that's when you most notice what, uh, what's progressing, what's thriving, how the wheel's turning for you, okay? If not multiple wheels. And Spirit's saying that's because in the next 48, you're so busy for the majority of John's this reading that it's kind of hard to to notice everything that's doing well working in your favor right successful um so yeah do wrap oneself up with both types of um times throughout the next 48 that was horribly put there are certain levels of conflict okay i feel like some people uh think you're competition interesting however that works for you and i feel like some of them are right but they don't need to stress it it's like stay in your own lane right for you and for others um but i also just feel like there's one situation in your life where you're reminded this involves levels of uneasy energy okay stressful nature um and just because it has its down times it's um comfortable moments doesn't mean that outweighs um, or makes those uneasy moments uh, acceptable, okay? You deserve a living situation or a job or a relationship that's comfortable, um, okay, easygoing and just helps you succeed more, right, 24-7. I mean, nothing's perfect, but you get the point, okay? Even a situation that's comfortable might have a moment or two um, that's a little bit abrupt, okay? I feel like that's a different situation. I'm being drawn again to Valiant Courage. I feel like your courage, your bravery is coming into play, okay? You, a very Six of Wands vibe, charging towards more victory for oneself and not, um, they're saying giving a damn, right? And that's not to be rude or insulting to others, but it's this feeling where you're charging forth in your own individual way and not uh, allowing for people to get you down or to get in your way. And if they do, you go around them or just um, politely ask for them to move. Does that make sense? Look at that. The six of wands, the six of wands being viewed as a star, my friend, being viewed as a star for, I want to say a different reason for each individual drawn to this reading. Okay. And any, um, cross watchers, I feel like you should be very proud of your Leo. Okay. And I sense that you are, but this reading may just remind you of just that. Interesting. I don't usually mention cross watchers. Um, but the queen of pentacles as well, because I do feel like there's a bit of a focus on your money, on your work, right, naturally, um, and you seeing oneself not stressing it. You're getting done more than you expect, right, More, you're, or just on time when you need to, and then you do other productive things. Um, 
But Spirit's also saying, why are you not stressing your money in the next 48? That's good because you know that things are coming into place, uh, falling into place as they're meant to. You know that the universe will replenish you when need be. But I also feel like for some, it does play into it that you are acquiring a new position or a new opportunity or another chance to make money, if not multiple, okay? I also do feel like, given I feel like I haven't stopped speaking for the most part in this reading, you'll be doing a lot of ranting, a lot of speaking, okay? But it will be productive, it will be on point, and you will receive clarity by the end of this 48-hour period, however that works for you. Could be more than one level. Um, but we also have the two of wands. You're going to surprise oneself by not focusing on what you don't have and focusing on acquiring what you desire. Interesting how that is very different, but can be looked at as the same, but you're more so, um, focusing on what's at hand, right? And making the best, um, spirits, very proud of you is what I'm getting. The number 99 coming into play with the nine of pentacles and the nine of cups. A wish fulfillment, to say the very least, is taking a highlight for you, whether it's coming to be in the next 48 or moving forward, okay, or just did. But I feel like your independent way of being is leaving this flowing in quite easily, nicely, and helping you adjust and make the best all the meanwhile. And I just feel like, once again, not surprised, as a Leo, you're manifesting a ton. And this reading, this next 48 hours, reminds you the possibilities are the possibilities, excuse me, are truly endless for you, regardless of certain slip-ups, regardless of certain levels of adjusting and chaos that does come to be at times. You're a star, and the next 48 reminds you of just that, all right? So I hope this was truly helpful. Sending you so much love and light. Go enjoy your next 48, and I'll definitely see you next time.